you know, the CRM landscape we are looking at today is drastically different from what we saw even just a few years ago. It used to be just about storing data, but now it's about AI-driven personalization, contextual automation, and having real transparency in your data. And both Zoho and Odoo seem to have taken this shift to heart. Here at CRM Central, we've been using both platforms for years, which gave us a really grounded perspective on their latest and most ambitious updates yet. Today, we aren't just listing specs, we're breaking down exactly how these changes improve your workflows and push mid-sized businesses forward. Getting straight into the experience, when you dive into Odoo's interface, it places small, individually labeled widgets directly on the homepage. It reminds you a bit of a smartphone screen. Each of these widgets represents a distinct function, whether it's sales, contacts, inventory, or other core areas. And because they're visually separated and clearly titled, navigating through them feels intuitive from the very start. Once you enter any module, Odoo keeps things clean and consistent. There's a strong sense of visual hierarchy, and the design avoids unnecessary distractions. It just prioritizes what it should be, functionality. On the other side, the first thing you'll notice with Zoho is the brand new interface. The old one wasn't bad, but this redesign feels far more modern and efficient. The biggest shift here is structural. Zoho moved from a top navigation bar to a vertical sidebar to free up screen space and create a more natural workflow. Previously, that top bar could get cluttered when multiple modules were active, which was a bit of a pain. The new left side navigation fixes that and introduces clear feature categorization. Core CRM functions like leads, contacts, and deals now sit neatly under modules, while reports and analytics live in their own section for better distinction between data and visuals. There's also a handy productivity hub tucked in the bottom right corner, which gives you one-click access to sticky notes, reminders, and accessibility tools. Overall, the new design is a 10 out of 10 upgrade that finally brings Zoho CRM's interface up to modern expectations. Once you have settled into the interface, the next logical step is managing the people. When you're managing contacts in Odoo, it starts with a clean interface showing you the basics, name, email, and phone number. But if you hit the button on the right, the view expands. That's where you'll see more advanced fields like tax ID, who the salesperson is, and any tags you've added for better organization. Odoo's sales pipeline system is structured to give you full control and visibility into your sales operations. By default, it includes predefined stages like new, qualified, proposition, and one. However, you're not stuck with just those. You're free to add, rename, or reorganize stages to reflect your actual sales process more accurately. Inside the pipeline, each opportunity gets an AI-generated probability score. This isn't just a number, it's based on past data and behavior patterns to give you a calculated prediction of whether a deal will close, which is a huge advantage for forecasting. Switching gears to Zoho, let's move to where the real CRM functionality happens, the modules section. This is the area where Zoho spent serious time refining usability. Your home tab displays open tasks, meetings, KPIs, and follow-ups at a glance. Then come the essentials, leads, contacts, and accounts. The latest update tightens data hygiene with improved deduplication and smoother transitions as leads become contacts and accounts. Revenue tracking happens in deals, which still offers the familiar Kanban view, but now extends to other areas like calls and tasks. You can visually track a deal's journey and even see the predictive scoring that estimates your chances of closing, which is a huge advantage for forecasting. Activity tools like calls, tasks, and meetings now feature better scheduling and venue preferences, which is ideal for hybrid teams. Supporting modules like campaigns, documents, and projects connect your pre- and post-sale processes seamlessly. The biggest functional change, however, is team modules, part of Zoho's CRM for Everyone vision. Each department, like a renewals or partner team, can now create its own mini CRM within the system, fully customized but still securely contained. It's perfect for large organizations needing both visibility and privacy. Of course, no CRM exists in a vacuum, it has to talk to your other tools. 
Odoo's biggest advantage here is how deeply its apps integrate across the platform. When you install an app, it's automatically placed on your main dashboard, right alongside your other tools, so it's ready to go. The real power is in how these apps communicate. For instance, the accounting app lets you create and process invoices right from your CRM, so you don't have to switch back and forth. The inventory app syncs in a similar way. Once connected, it updates stock levels in real time. That means if a sales rep is finalizing a deal, they already know what's in stock. This interlinked system keeps your data accurate and accessible across departments, which ultimately helps your business run smoother. On the other hand, Zoho's integration system has always been one of its biggest strengths, but they take a slightly different approach. The marketplace is your one-stop hub for all integrations, neatly categorized between Zoho's own suite, Microsoft tools, and external extensions. The synergy within Zoho's ecosystem remains unmatched. CRM now connects effortlessly with Zoho Books, Zoho Desk, and Zoho Campaigns, which allows instant data sharing across marketing, finance, and support. This means means no more wrestling with APIs or data mismatches. Beyond the core numbers and pipelines, it is often the little things that define your daily experience. Odoo adds a lot more value than just your typical CRM system because it's built with teamwork in mind. One of the standout tools is the Discuss app. Think of it like your own internal messaging platform. You can make different channels for teams or projects, and it keeps conversations neat and easy to follow. You can chat directly with someone, share files, or jump into a quick video or voice call without switching to another app. And then there's Odoobot. It's kind of like having a built-in helper that actually makes a difference. If something's unclear or you run into a snag, Odoobot steps in with suggestions or walks you through what to do next. You're not left guessing. The calendar app rounds it all out. It's not just a spot to mark appointments, it's fully functional and syncs with Google Calendar to keep everything aligned. You can even add video meeting links right from the calendar itself. It's all integrated, so you don't have to juggle a bunch of tools. Everything just works together. Zoho, meanwhile, has slipped in several quality-of-life upgrades that make daily use smoother. The search bar has been supercharged. You can now choose which module to search before typing, delivering more accurate results. Typing the at symbol triggers contextual search, instantly narrowing down results. Adding new data is faster than ever with the Add New shortcut. No need to navigate through multiple screens. You can instantly create a new lead, deal, or task from anywhere in the system. The calendar module also got smarter. You can schedule meetings, log calls, and mark yourself unavailable to prevent overlap. It's now cohesive enough to replace standalone scheduling tools, ensuring every team member's availability is accurate across the organization. These small details might not grab headlines, but they make a big difference day to day, showing Zoho's focus on refining productivity, not just adding flashy features. So, where does that leave us? If you want a modular system where inventory, accounting, and sales live in one unified app-style interface, Odoo is the winner. It feels like building a custom ERP from the ground up. But if you need a powerhouse dedicated CRM with superior data hygiene, external integrations, and deep analytics right out of the box, Zoho CRM takes the crown. It's faster to deploy and better suited for sales-heavy teams. Drop a comment below on which one you'd pick, and don't forget to subscribe for more deep dives. Thanks for watching.